Well, I saw this story last week, but I couldn't quite wrap my mind around the importance of it. There's a reorg at Microsoft and the Application Services Group. Mary Jo, uh, what can you tell us about this? Um, so this was kind of a big surprise to a lot. I'd say most, if not all of us, Microsoft watchers. Right after Ignite ended, Microsoft announced the next day that Chi Lu, who's one of the three executive vice presidents at the company, was going to be stepping down. And Chi Lu is the guy who has been running um, the Office and Bing team for the past several years. He came to Microsoft from Yahoo. Uh, the word is that he was in a very serious biking accident and he's having trouble recovering. So I'm, I'm actually here in Seattle this week uh, for the GeekWire conference. That's where I'm. That's why I'm in a hotel room today. Uh, and. I've been asking around and it sounds like he was in a very serious accident and possibly broke his hip in this biking That's accident. True. Yeah. Uh, and But you know what's crazy is people I know who work at Microsoft and, you know, not everybody sees the executive vice presidents every day, but everyone's like, wow, I didn't even know something happened to him. He seemed to be coming into the office and nobody seemed to – or that – or no one – no, he wasn't coming into the office. So this kind of hit everybody out of the blue like, wow, he was in a biking accident and now he's leaving. Um, he's an interesting guy because uh, I had heard a lot of talk that he and Satya Nadella were very, very close, and I believe they are very close. Some people had even speculated Nadella might be looking to move him into a higher level position or um, kind of more of a direct role where he would be working hand in hand with him. So for him to suddenly be gone is pretty significant. Uh, Microsoft did say after he recovers, he's going to come back in an advisory role to Nadella and Gates. But... It's not clear how active he'll be in that role or what that exactly looks like. So that that was kind of a shock. And then they took his division and kind of split it in half. They took all the Bing and the Cortana team. They moved them in with Microsoft Research and created a new combined AI and research group. And they took the part of the team that was Office and they uh, put that under a guy who is also a long-term Microsoft guy, Rajesh Jha, who... I think at one point was running Exchange at Microsoft. Now he has all of the Office uh, applications and Skype as well. So Gurdeep Paul, who Paul and I have both recently been speaking with, um, I is love. gone. I mean, like, I love gone. that guy. That's, <laughs> yep. that's he's, sad. I think he's still going to stay at Microsoft, although I haven't heard definitively what his new job will be, Gurdeep Paul. Uh, so his the Skype team is rolling into the main Office team, and Rajesh is Rajesh Jha is taking that entire team and now running that. So it, it is a pretty big deal. That that That's Office crazy. and Bing team is kind of like the quiet team out of the three. You know, you've got the Windows and Devices team under Terry Meyerson. You've got Cloud and Enterprise under Scott Guthrie. And then you had this Applications and Services group under, under uh, Chi Lu. And that was kind of like the mysterious team, you know, especially the Bing part. You, you never really heard a lot about like, what are those guys doing? I mean, they're running the search engine, but they're doing a lot more than that. They're, they are very um, instrumental to what Microsoft's doing in artificial intelligence. So yeah, uh, it's a very big change that it was just kind of like out of the blue. No, I, I don't think anybody had a leak on it or, or maybe just like the night before um, Recode heard that Chi Lu may be stepping down for some reason. So yeah, it was pretty big. A big so change. the first bike crash to affect 5,000 people.